Bill O'Reilly is convinced that there's bias in the press. I don't know if you know that. Uh, and he came out and said uh, that CNN has not adequately been covering the story of uh, another shooting. This happened last week, right? They covered the story of George Tiller being shot, the abortion doctor, but he claimed they did not cover the shooting of some U.S. Uh, troops here in the U.S. by a Muslim convert. Rick Sanchez took issue with this on CNN because he was there when they covered it. So first, let's show you Rick Sanchez uh, delivering the bitch slap to O'Reilly. This uh, next segment is about uh, two things, really. It is about Bill O'Reilly, Bill O'Reilly and the truth, that is. This is about the story involving a Muslim convert accused of killing U.S. Army Private William Long. It's a sad story that, as you've seen in our coverage, has expanded now even beyond that. But listen to what Bill O'Reilly says about CNN's uh, coverage of accused killer Abdul Hakim Mohammed. The cable channels as well. They're over covering things like this all the time. Not this one. Not Sergeant Long. Things get over covered no all way. the time. Look, Doesn't mean it's right. I agree. On CNN you only. Can point to a lot of issues where that happens. CNN is supposed to be the news channel. Isn't all right. Fox and MSNBC is supposed no, to be. No, no. But CNN says, look, we we we, we don't give opinion. We do mm -hmm. news. Only Anderson Cooper at 10 o'clock covered this right. story. No, Nobody don't. else. You're right. So and all day long it wasn't news to cover an army recruiter gunned down in Arkansas. All right, let's see. Just, 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 just to be accurate here and to quote. He says, all day long, nobody else, nobody. Roger, do me a favor. Let's check the tape. Let's see if, in fact, it was just Anderson Cooper. Just into CNN, two soldiers in Little Rock, Arkansas. A man accused of shooting a soldier and wounding another. Authorities believe the suspect was angry about military operations. One of our soldiers was killed and another wounded. Another breaking story that I'm following for you. Two military recruiters in full uniform. I mean, listen to this. Two military recruiters in full uniform have been shot repeatedly. One of them is... Wow. Anderson Cooper, huh? You know, that last guy there, if he was Anderson Cooper, Anderson Cooper's looking very Cuban these days. Um, Roger, any more? A 23-year-old Arkansas man has been arraigned in a shooting that left one U.S. soldier dead. A man arrested in connection with a fatal shooting at a military recruiting center in Little Rock, Arkansas, faces a court hearing today. In Little Rock, Arkansas, where one soldier was killed and another wounded. He was intending to kill U.S. soldiers on American soil and that he... All right, let's see. That was uh, Kira Phillips, Tony Harris, Heidi Collins, Lou Dobbs. Uh, certainly you saw myself. You just saw David Mattingly there. Uh, Wolf Blitzer, we saw Kieran Chetri, uh, we saw Erica Hill, that's nobody. But Bill O'Reilly says he only saw it once. And since he only saw it once, well then that must be the truth. It doesn't matter what really happened, it doesn't matter what the record shows, all that matters is what Bill thinks he saw. We called Fox today, by the way, no response yet. Well. We should also note this. O'Reilly did get one thing right. We here at CNN do say we're in the business of doing news. You know why? Because we are. And while we are far from perfect, we do check our facts before we say things. And if we get it wrong, we say so. And that is called reporting. Booyah! How you like them apples, Billo? Or as Rick Sanchez says, Bill O'Reilly. Bill O'Reilly. <laughs> I don't know why he pronounces it that way, but I'm amused by it. So, uh, Stone Cold busted. And uh, also, Sanchez pointed out uh, in that piece, in the middle of that piece, uh, that uh, O'Reilly had said, oh, they didn't even cover the fact that he's a Muslim convert. Rick Sanchez showed a piece of, uh, of a broadcast from the earlier days where Rick Sanchez is saying, get a load of this! He's a Muslim convert! So they absolutely positively did cover that. In fact, they brought on a guest from the FBI to talk about, hey, is this a terrorism case, et cetera, et cetera. So, I mean, Bill O'Reilly could not have been more wrong. So this is the point uh, in the story when usually you get uh, a Fox News stepping in and say, hell no, man, we got it right anyway. Piss off, right? But something surprising happened in this case. First, JRJ. Even, yeah, even before that, I, I did just notice. Um, I mean, I'm not, I'm not talking any trash to the guy, but um, did you notice? And maybe we've done the same thing if we were with a Young Turks news channel. 
there was little tidbits of everyone else's. Oh, so this happened, and this happened, and this happened. Then his was nice and long. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and then the part we cut out was two minutes of Rick Sanchez. But, you know, the part of the reason that he got upset, Sanchez didn't, and he's right to, to rub it in O'Reilly's face, is like, look, man, I spent, I don't know, half an hour in this one of the segments he said was 17 minutes long. And what, I don't count? <laughs> right here, man, I did the story. I know I did the story because it was me, right? So I, 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 I'll give him that, no question, right? So, but get a load of this. I, this might be unprecedented. I'm not sure it's ever happened before. I'm not going to say it didn't because I haven't uh, looked through all of Fox News' archives, but it's the first I can remember. An actual correction on the factor. Let's check it out. And uh, I do want to tell you about one thing also. We have a correction, a rare correction on the fact. Earlier this week I said that only Anderson Cooper on CNN covered the murder of Private Long in Arkansas. Well, today a snide and surly guy on CNN <laughs> pointed out that the story was covered more extensively by that network, and that is true. I was wrong. My apologies to CNN. I was talking about prime time, but I did not say that. Uh, and so I was wrong. As they say in third grade, my bad. Now, on Monday, we'll have more on how CNN handled the uh, Private Long and Tiller story. You're going to make a comparison, so don't miss that. In other words, they're going to come back and double that. <laughs> okay, but nonetheless, hey, you know what? We'll take it. Because I thought they were completely impervious to facts. I thought, you know, you can show them 20 clips in a row, and they'll be like, yeah, no. Your eyes are lying to you. <laughs> That's not true. But hey, it turns out you show them about 10 clips in a row, and he goes... As they say in third grade. Do they say that in third grade? <laughs> My bad. And But one last thing. This is snide and surly guy. Hey, you're apologizing to him. <laughs> okay? <laughs> Isn't that? <laughs> and surly. Uh, that's, in the words of Newt Gingrich, that sounds a little racialist to me. <laughs> I don't know what that's about. Watch more clips at theyoungturks.com.